Hey y'all, welcome to Barlow Barbecue Halloween Special. Strange things always happen to me on Halloween. We'll keep our eyes peeled, you never know what can happen. We're gonna be making a pulled pork cheesesteak today with a very special mojo mayo sauce. And plenty of garlic to keep away the vampires. Watch out. We're going to start by putting together our mojo mayo. So our mayo is going to start with, you guessed it, mayo. We're going to put in about half a cup. To that, we're going to add the juice of one lime. some salt and pepper, minced garlic and onion, lots of it. And to that, I'm adding some olive oil, and in that I sauteed up some cumin and some oregano. Just gonna get all of that in there. And then we're just gonna mix all this up. Oh, that looks crazy great and put it in the fridge till later. All right, folks, you just saw Martha make that mojo mayo. Now it's time to get the grill going. And uh, we're just gonna cook everything direct on our cast iron skillet. And, and hold on a second. Martha's walking up to me. Martha, I'm filming a shot yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, but the, look what I found. Oh, this, oh, this is my little Therm Pro transmitter. I left it out in the rain last night like a dingus. Does it still work? I don't know. Let's uh, let's try it out. Whoa! Wait a second. I think turning this on transported us into some kind of weird alternate dimension. I think I'm gonna be sick. Yeah, that was weird, and, and everything's in black and white. What happened? Well, I think that we're at our house. It's all black and white here. It's pretty strange. All right, folks, I, I think I hear something coming from where our grills usually are. Let's go check it out. I think we can uh, sneak behind that little thing right there. Do you hear that? Yeah, you know what's really weird about those voices? Hello. Yeah, it kind of sounds like us, doesn't it? Yeah. I'm gonna go take a peek over this and see what I can, what I can find out. Shh. Me too. Okay, let's look. Okay folks, I've got a chimney full of charcoal going right back here and I'm going to need a lot of heat to get our cast iron skillet cooking. So this should be ready in about 10-15 minutes and I'll catch you back then when it's time to get to cooking. It's sandwich making time. We're going to use some mustard, some pepperoncinis, some jalapenos, and of course our mojo mayo. First thing we got to do is warm up that pork. Okay, folks, I've got my charcoal here on my Weber kettle grill and it's time to start cooking. Whoa, that's pretty weird. We're in this weird alternate reality where we're sock puppets. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah. Check it again. Okay, I'm gonna try to hit this again. Okay, I think we're back to our own dimension again. All right. Hey, hey look at that. The skillet's on the grill already going for us. Let's make those sandwiches. Yeah, let's finish up the sandwiches. We'll start by adding just a little bit of butter. And we've got our pork. Now we're gonna add some cumin. And we're gonna add some oregano. 
season that up just a little bit. A little stir. While that's warming up, we're going to get our bread ready to go. So we're adding a little bit of some garlic aioli mustard. Some pickled pepperoncini slices. Some pepperoncinis. And some pickled jalapenos. And then last, we're going to slather that with some of that mojo mayo that we made earlier. Recipe for all this stuff is going to be down below in the description box, folks. Beautiful. Now I've got some extra butter that I'm going to get melting over here on the side, along with about three to four cloves of smashed garlic. You'll see what this is all about in just a minute. So I'm going to throw the pork in this butter and garlic and just kind of mix that in there. Just a little bit. Now it's time to add our cheese. We got some Munster cheese, because it's Halloween after all, right? And we're just gonna take a little moment and let that melt on there, just like you would a cheesesteak, folks. step we're gonna attempt boy this thing is crazy <laughs> we're gonna attempt it we're gonna throw it on here and we're gonna try to press it just like you would like a panini look at that folks all right let's uh, give this a try it's good to be back in our own dimension I told you weird things always happen to me on Halloween. <laughs> Who knew? Cheers to you guys for hanging out with us today and for spending some time and happy Halloween to you guys. Mm. In case you're wondering, we're enjoying a little bit of uh, some nice smoky scotch right now. So Martha, do we have a name for these sandwiches here? I think I'm gonna call them the Munster Mash. Now that sounds good to me. Let's try it out. It looks absolutely delicious. It looks like it's from <laughs> another dimension. <laughs> That tastes out of this world. Oh yeah, it's almost scary how good this tastes. <laughs> Try another bite. I love the richness that you get with all the butter and the mayo and the pork and the, the garlic really comes through. I love everything about this sandwich. And yeah. you did a great job cooking this pork the other day. Thanks a lot. That's part of it too, you know. Well, I believe I'm gonna wrap it up. Thanks a lot for spending some time with us today. And cheers once again. Hope you have a safe and happy Halloween. I'm sure glad to be back in our own dimension. Oh yeah, it's good to be back home. <laughs> hey y'all, till next time, we're gonna say smoke them if you got them. That's right. We'll see you soon. Action. It's sandwich making time. We're gonna put some, okay, wait a minute. And your puppet looks shitty. <laughs>